here on today's TMT4. And now to some breaking news. A Capitol Police officer has been stabbed in the neck. This happened at the State Office Building, downtown Milwaukee. Cody Holyoke is live at 6th and Wells. Cody, what do we know about what happened to this police officer? Tom and Annie, good afternoon. Yeah, we are right here at Six and Wells. All we've been told right now is that he was stabbed in the neck. Uh, you can see uh, Milwaukee police officers are swarming this scene right now. They've shut down the lobby. They're letting some people in for the Department of Motor Vehicles, things like that. But as you can see, the sign here, fourth floor taxpayer assistance and lottery is closed for the day. From what we've been learning from the uh, Capitol Police, who just gave us a, a press release just so, a while ago, so forgive me if I'm reading, but two Capitol Police officers shortly after 1 o'clock responded to a duress alarm here on the fourth floor of the state office building in Milwaukee. When officers responded, they were confronted by a male suspect who reportedly stabbed one of these officers in the neck. The injured officer was taken to freighter, I'm being told by my sources at Milwaukee Police Department, with non-life-threatening injuries. We've been told that officer is in stable condition and no other state employees are reported to be injured. As you can see now, officers have really locked down uh, this building as far as uh, keeping the media out. There is some evidence. We've seen uh, some blood-soaked rags in the lobby, even though this has happened on the fourth floor. Uh, we also got a statement just a little while ago from Mike Hipsch, the uh, secretary of the Department of Administration for Wisconsin. He said, our thoughts are with our injured Capitol Police officer. We are thankful that he's in stable condition. We're also thinking about all of our officers who put themselves in harm's way each day and ask that you send your thoughts to everyone involved in this situation. So right now, Milwaukee police still uh, combing for clues right now. We have been told that the man who uh, allegedly did this is not in police custody. So there's a two prong approach to this uh, right now where they're looking for clues and now searching for a suspect as well. Live in downtown Milwaukee, Cody Holyoke, today's TMJ4. And Cody, important to point out that at this point they have not put out a description of the suspect for us to pass along. Uh, and if we do get one, we would put it here on today's TMJ4. All right. All right thanks, Cody.